hospital, but also another genetic disorder that's also located at 1934? Um, I heard of a case that was strongly suggestive of that. Um, it wasn't, I didn't see them and I didn't get a DNA sample, so I don't know exactly what it was, but I could, I could understand how it would have happened. Yes, a gene just a little bit further down the chromosome and one chromosomal event affected both genes, so it's perfectly possible. I also know of a case where, just by chance, there was a new mutation in LMX1B causing Neil Patella syndrome and another new mutation, another gene causing achondroplasia, and so the child had both of those disorders. My daughter was born with two sclerosis. Okay, yeah, that's on chromosome 9, so... Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.